Well, I, I've probably known Matt for 20 plus years. We were at a conference for the International Union and kind of struck up a conversation, found out that we kind of had like interest, both like the duck hunt, both like the hunt. Just kind of hit it off and then over the years, um, you know, see each other at different conferences, different conventions. So it's just been a course of, you know, 20 years, once or twice a year, we see each other and catch up and, you know, until the next time. I've got one from Boston. That's it. They're not, we don't, we don't get them. They don't come that far down in the lakes. Nice bird. Brotherhood Outdoors is presented by Ulico, supporting the American worker for over 90 years. I've known Ken for roughly about 18 years or so since I've been in the administration in the union. Just a real big, gentle giant, super nice guy, and just a gem of a guy to be around. He duck hunts, I duck hunt, hit it off a while ago, and uh, I've invited him out to Washington. He's come out and hunted with me a few times over in Washington, and we just have a lot in common. It's cool to be able to have someone you can call and talk to and see, you know, how he's doing something. How'd you handle this? He's, he's a straight shooter. No, it, it just wouldn't work for me. Or, yeah, we've been doing that for years. And, you know, it's, it's great to have that relationship. Uh, just trying to pick out some nice drakes to shoot. You know, light's a little low right now, so I don't want to, uh, uh, don't want to shoot a bunch of hens, you know? So, uh, trying to see the birds, trying to see if we can see some color on them, make sure we shoot some nice drakes. Waterfall hunting is, this is the, the release from all the other stuff that builds up. It's an opportunity to just kick back, relax, have fun, shoot a few birds. It, it's just a fun opportunity to to be outdoors. And you just spend some time. Spending time in the marsh or out on the water um, with somebody, it, it builds even a greater bond and just being able to share those moments together and share with everybody. When, you, when you're in the boat, it's like you get to know people and it's, uh, I love it. It's awesome. Been, wait, been waiting for that uh, Drake Eider to come in and uh, been kind of selective all morning. Don't want to shoot up all our birds, you know, and so I've been kind of waiting for that Drake and uh, there he went. Got 42 years in this last summer. I think it was a little emotional about it. Because um, it's everything. You know, the union has provided for me everything I have. From when I was working in the field, first coming in, to when I was running work as a foreman, to when I moved into an administrative role and kind of worked my way up from a field representative to the director. Every step along the way has been a progression. Learning curve something different, something exciting, but it has always provided for me and my family. And that's, that's what we're about, trying to take care of our membership, take care of our community. All those things are all part of who we are. And I think that's the biggest thing that people don't see. Good job. Well time been a long day. <laughs> My goodness. These are a little special here. Been a long time coming, getting back up here to, to get a few birds. Just haven't been able to hit them. We've had them. We've had the opportunities, just not been able to fulfill my part of it. But glad to get one now. We've done a uh, handicapped youth hunt down in Southern Ohio in the corner down by Portsmouth. We built fishing docks in the, in the Ohio capital in Columbus. You know, build a fishing pier for the kids. This was my 10th year doing the Union Sportsman's Alliance sporting clay shoot for our area. We're everyday people in our community doing for other people. And then we get the benefit back from being able to do that. That's what makes it so cool.